All right. Um, tonight I'll be um, talking about uh, Neko AutoCAD or computer aided drawing question or questions, and I'll be providing answers to the questions. As you can see on the screen, this paper is paper one. And in this paper one of NECO technical drawing, it is divided into uh, three parts. So the first part is section A that you can see on the screen, which is on computer aided drawing or AutoCAD. The second part is on beauty drawing, and that is section B. And also section B, uh, let me call it section B2. That one is on mechanical drawing. So this first part here, which is section A, is on computer aided drawing or AutoCAD, and it carries 30 marks. As you can see on the screen, the question says that the instruction says that answer all questions in this section. Actually, you do have five questions under this particular section. So um, let's go through the questions. Then I'll provide answers to each of the questions. Question one says that list any six features of AutoCAD interface. That's question one. And question two says that mention the tools that performs each of the following tasks below. So we shall look at the answers to that. And question three says that group the tools listed below under the following edits, draw, dimension, and modify. Yonder it, we have chamfer, linear, ellipse, offset, diameter, trim. And question four says that list any four zoom commands. And question five says that when dimensioning from the command line, what do the following abbreviations mean? Now let's look at the answer without wasting much of our time. Now, question one, list any six features of AutoCAD interface. So the answers, as you can see on the screen, we have command prompt or command line, we have view cube, we have drawing area, quick access to bar, status bar, UCS icon, layout tabs, ribbon, application menu, by tabs, cross air of, of, or cursor, I wanted to put our cursor there. And then we have drawing name information center. So those are the answers to question one that says we should list six, any, any six features of AutoCAD interface. So those are the answers. So you actually mentioned six, but I put more than six there. So take note of that. Now, question two, mention the tools that performs each of the follow each, each of the tasks below. So the first one, Roman figure one is copy. So when you see a diagram like this, so you ask to mention the tools that can be used to perform this particular uh, task, you use copy for this. And the second one, the second one is mirror. So the task or the tool that, it, that is being used to perform this particular task is known as mirror. And third one is plan. So the tool that is used to perform this particular function or task is known as spline. Now question 30 says that group the, lead, the tools listed below under the following edits, draw, dimension, and modify. Now looking at the table that I've prepared here, so, here we have ellipse as a drawing tool. Ellipse is a drawing tool. Linear and diameter, they are dimension tools. Chamfer, offset, and trim, they are modified tools. So take note of that. Then question four says that list any zoom, any four zoom commands. List any four zoom commands. So I listed more than four, so you can 
uh, you can put, uh, just take any folder that you like. So we have Zoom All, Zoom Center, Zoom Dynamic, Zoom Instant, Zoom Previous, and Zoom Scale. So those are the uh, Zoom commands. Then question five, which is the last question that says that when dimensioning from the command line, what do the following abbreviations mean? So the first one is horizontal. The first one is horizontal, and the second one is vertical. The third one is intersect, and the fourth one is perpendicular. So those are the answers to the questions that we are given as NECO questions for a computer aided drawing or AutoCAD. So go through this and study them. So I will still do more on this. So thank you for watching and thank you for listening. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please subscribe so that you can learn more and then put on the notification bell so that whenever I upload a new video, you'll be notified. Thank you for watching and thank you for listening. God bless you.